G Town Tom for everything that he's done. Like, just ban me from New England melee yeah. because he's he's the goat. He's actually like living legend. Like, and it's not just New England that he helped out with. As like, a whole. Yeah, yeah. Like he's seated nationals. He's one of the TOs for a uh, big house. Absolutely. Rest in peace. See him at every big house. And yeah. He, he genuinely cares a lot. Like, but. I would say enough about G-Town, but there's never enough about G-Town. <laughs> we have a match to, uh, match yeah, to compensate. Yeah, so Paladin, Tennessee Fox. Um, very fast. Yeah, very I fast. I used to think it was a rectangle fox when I uh, played him for the first <laughs> time because of just how precise he is. Wait, you can see his controller or something? Uh, we were playing in other means. Oh, I see, I see. Interesting. And uh, Goose Con, he is kind of a demon versus foxes. Uh, my One of my favorite sets of 2023 was the come up, uh, which was an on uh, was like a Toronto tournament run by Gommel, uh, not Gommel, uh, EMG. Sure, yeah, and I remember. It's game five, last stop. Goose Con versus Aklo. Oh my gosh, Aklo really? That was not a name I expected yeah. you to say for this. Aklo is up being off stage at like a 90% or so. All Goose Con has to do is run off stage and knee him. Goose Con runs off stage. <laughs> And knees nothing. And dies a beautiful, <laughs> brutal death. He was a couple of frames off of beating a top 10 player. Well, at least he's got some family guy clips to keep him company, I suppose. I thought he could shine there. But yeah, so yeah, Goose yeah. a crazy player. He goes balls off the wall. Uh, lets and Paladin so fast. And Paladin's really so fast. fast. Unstoppable Force beats another Unstoppable Force. Because both these players are extremely aggressive. I, uh, You're not gonna see any camp in here. I personally have to have to root a little bit for any of my southeast homies. Not many of us out here at wavelength, but there there are a few. Yeah, I mean, you, you got a root, you got a rep. And yeah, we got a halftime here for so long. Oh, big tag chase on Goose Con's What's he gonna get? Ooh. Oh, and covers the slide off too with that upper. Beautiful stuff on Goose Con. Yeah, Paladin does get back. Maybe get a little chip here. Oh, oh, more than a little chip. Yeah, All I right. actually really like going for the shine grab on the platform because yeah. if uh, Goose Con is SDIing up and away, um, he actually lands that grab off the okay, shine. Okay, yeah, off the shine. That makes and sense. The only other thing you can do off that is like wave dash down or like drill, and drill sends down. Nair doesn't really get too much. Whereas if you get that grab, you can just keep juggling Falcon for a really long time. Yeah. So I think it, I think it was a good idea to get him in a workout. Right. How then with an edge guard? No. The returning knee. Ooh. Waveland off laser, looking like a Falco. Well, <laughs> I love the little movement drills. Oh, what's Goose Con gonna do? Hits the bear. Calvin still makes it back, but wow. for how long? That spacing on that the back here was immaculate. Yeah, like, that was perfect. He avoided the invincible fox daring from ledge. Like the perfect invincible fox during much. Yeah. That was a like flawless ledge dash, and just back aired him as the invincibility was running out. Yeah, like the moment, the moment. The moment. Yeah. That is insanely hard to do. Like, oh my god. Who's caused a monster in this game? He's looking really, really good right now. Very clean. And Tennessee doesn't have any Falcons, right? Dave Mon uh, uh, retired to League of Legends, right? I mean, yeah, they kind of had Moist. Uh, moist is chic now, though. Yeah. Um, and that might be a different part of Tennessee anyways, so. How often does, uh, do you know if Paladin ever goes down to play with the Georgia people, like uh, the bad Pal people? Paladin's gotten a little bit of travel. He's certainly not um, going out every other weekend or uh -huh. anything, but yeah, no, he, he's, I saw him at Riptide too, you know, he, yeah. he travels. And I mean, Goose Con, I mean, yeah. There's, there's gotta be at least one or two decent foxes in Toronto, right? Oh yeah. Like, I, yeah. I can't think of any off the top of my head, but I'm sure there's at least one. Ooh, a little short, but that's all right. Three socks and three. I was being facetious. By the I'm way. aware. I'm, sure I'm well aware I, that there are I'm good just, boxes just, in Ontario. <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, uh, that's funny. Right. Lots oh. of scrambles right now in that unfortunate Randall placement. Curse of Randall saying, this is Wave, but not Gobble. Doesn't last for that long. <laughs> yeah, he's so like he's so ruthless. Like if he finds a stomp, he will make so much off of it. Yeah, yeah. Like not even that he's gonna he doesn't do it in the Wizzy style where like he'll react to it and have like a flow chart for it. Like he is a very Bab slash Nun esque Falcon where he just does stuff and lets it stick. Uh huh. 
the little uh, hamster wheel in his head. Sort of like saying, a. I want to hit the fox. There's a little bit of like player versus player vibe rather than doing the same thing every time, right? Yeah. Like, he also, like, you can see with his, uh, how he covers characters off stage, where he'll sometimes just raw knee, like, really deep off stage and have to recover with up Bs. Uh -huh. And sometimes get punished for it. Yeah. But, like, the, the, the risk reward sometimes just isn't there. Like, he just goes through stuff. It worked out there. Yeah, the catching the jump with the weak knee, yeah. Ooh, Ooh turn around up Jelly smash. smash. And. Did you say jelly smash? I did. That's, that's, so that's an old school North Carolina thing. That's fun. Sorry, we were talking. To, me and Meat were talking about it in the car. <laughs> I keep forgetting that Meat's here. Yeah. Whoa. yeah. Oh, nasty edge guard. Ooh, right into Fox's face and up there with like his his thigh. That's that's baller. I can't believe we went Dang, for that. Goosecon is kind of gaming on Paladin right now. We're going right back to Yoshi's. Go Goosecon just guaranteed himself top 100 ballot off this tournament. So he's chilling. Yeah. Up 201 Paladin too, another ballot player. Like he's. Whoa! No, oh, that was scary. Did your did your heart also like just skip a beat there? A, a little bit, just a little bit. Oh no! I think Paladins did too. Yeah, yeah, just that little unfortunate drop uh, that Fox has on up B if he's going down already is. He's yeah. is a machine. Look oh, at him no. go. Ooh. All right, Paladin's got to dig deep if he wants to keep this set going. Keep this tournament run going at all. Wow. Okay, all right, cover, all right. Cover the ramp. Cover the yeah, ramp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But this, is, this is a body bag. Right. He's got playing out of his mind right now. Paladin? All right, Paladin. Big, a big punish. Yeah, 54 already. Uh, he's going to cover that air oh. dodge. Keep the tech chase going. Oh, great Love cover on the slide. Uh, yeah, yeah Randall. so much space. It also covers the ledge if he's trying to drip the uh -huh. ledge too, so it's really smart on Paladin's part. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Another one? Oh, no. Oh! Oh, huge. Shades of Evo 27. It was 2017, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, Moonwalks! Alright, All right, he's playing with his food right now. Oh, and he's using this moves should be to it. Should... Alright, it's not, but it could have. Alright. And that'll do it. That was that was really fast. That was dominant. It was like 7 minute 3 0. I think, especially losing the momentum by losing game 2 for Paladin was just kind of a, a death knell for the rest of the set. Yeah, I. That was oh, that was fantastic. Guzcon was playing on a hundred every single yeah. time, like every every stock, and then he went up so much game three, and he's like, all right.